and I'm pretty much gonna shove my fist up their butt. What's up guys, my name is Cole and welcome back. So obviously you guys have a few questions because I promised you guys I was either going to upload Thursday or Friday and as of right now today is Saturday and you're probably like, Cole, WTF is going on and actually I have a pretty good excuse for this one. Um, so actually I was planning on uploading yesterday and I actually got back yesterday but, um, <coughs> ugh, sorry about that. But I actually had some laser surgery done on my face, as well as some other parts of my body, and so I'm pretty fucking sore, and it's really hard for me to do stuff, and that's pretty much why I haven't been able to upload, and uh, stuff like that, I don't know, it's kind of hard to talk, because uh, my face is absolutely, like, wrecked, it looks like someone ran over me with a car, uh, but that's okay, I mean, it's all worth it, but yeah, so, if you guys are interested, um... You probably, you probably aren't interested, I don't know. I'm just going to go ahead and get right into the video and quit boring you guys, but basically that's where I was and what was happening. So today we're going to be going over some Clan Wars stuff, uh, because I was planning on doing a live Clan Wars attack yesterday, but I just wasn't feeling up to the commentary. Uh, so we're actually going to be doing a recap of one of my attacks on a top 4 player of the enemy clan as well as uh, one of my defenses and I thought it was pretty funny so I'll go ahead and get right into that for you guys so as you can see off the bat we won this war pretty handily uh, let's go ahead and check out our war record looking so far uh, we are 24 war wins in uh, we recently have been on a really great streak uh, we have one two three four five six six win winning streak absolutely amazing I'm super happy with how we are doing uh, but let's go ahead and check out the war map and look at this defense. So as you can see on my base, I defended with 49% against this kid named Malo. So let's go ahead and see what Malo has to do on my uh, on his attack or whatever it's called. <coughs> Sorry you guys, my voice is a little fucked up. Um, hopefully that will get better. But yeah, I mean, so by the looks of it, this Malo kid is using Barch and... I don't blame him, I have a lot of buildings on the outside, but clearly, uh, Malo is pretty much retarded, and I don't blame him at all, but he thought it was a good idea to attack my base, and clearly anyone that attacks my base is set up to fail because I am just that boss, and by the looks of it, he's doing pretty good. He has 38% already, and looks like he used all of his troops on the outside. Little does he know, my clan castle came out to play. And they are about to take out those little wimpy hog riders that he put down. Um, my king is obviously very pissed off and confused by the question mark on his head. And here Malo goes and drops a barrage of spells. Uh, he's very artistic and special ed. Uh, he likes the pretty colors and doesn't really know that he should probably use those spells earlier. But uh, my clan castle troops, wizards, and archers easily took out those guys and as you can see right there that queen was very like king she loves the king and he drops all those lightning spells taking out almost everything except for this one builder set so pretty epic 49 percent defense uh good try malo but obviously not good enough for colson so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys my last attack in the war and keep in mind that this is when all the bases were pretty much starred up to the max uh, two stars, three stars, and I felt like this is the base that I could get the most stars off of at the moment. Um, I didn't actually win the attack, but it was a really crazy attack. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the base really quick and let you know that it actually was a maxed out Town Hall 10. And this is actually about 30 or 40 ranks uh, below me, so attacking this high is absolutely crazy. And I'm super surprised that I did this well. Um, so first off, I drew out his clan castle troops, bring them to the top, and I'm pretty much going to shove my fist up their butt, and here they go, um, drop down, I think a few barbarians right here, come on, there you go, a few archers, uh, one of my wizards, and that guy is going to do some damage on their wizards, nope, no he's not, just kidding, uh, I sent him another one, and, you know, I felt I took out enough of his troops, so I was like, YOLO, uh, let's start the attack from the bottom side. Now, as you look at the base right here, his town hall is really close to the outside, so I was like, you know, I can get in there really fast, especially with my new jump spell, so what I did was I dropped the golem here, 
a golem right here. Um, raids them both because I know that all my troops behind them, uh, we're going to be following up that golem. As you can see, the defenses are absolutely tearing through my level 1 golems. I mean, it's just absolute havoc. Dropped all my P.E.K.K.A.s as well as, well as that jump spell right into the center. Um, looks like all my troops over there got taken out, but that's no problem. One of my P.E.K.K.A.s is going to the outside, and the rest of my troops are in the inside. Finally got my Archer Queen. She's level 1, but, you know, she's still looking sexy. So, as you can see, we're already at 34%. Dropped down my last raid spell. Uh, raged up the king a little bit early, but that's okay. One P.E.K.K.A. left, and he's just getting annihilated by two maxed out Teslas. It was all up to my queen, and she didn't have the juice. Look at how close that town hall was. Uh, honestly, if she had her royal ability, I uh, definitely would have been able to get at least one star on that base. But, you know, I feel really happy with that attack. 40%, and honestly, 40% on a maxed out base with level 1 golems. Absolutely crazy, and I'm definitely happy with the results. Well, I think that's going to put a wrap to today's video, you guys. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like. Uh, and also, I gained a few new subscribers, so if you are new to the channel, welcome, and I hope you enjoy your stay and my content. So, this is probably going to be the only video I'm going to upload for today. I might upload um, two tomorrow. I'm not sure yet. It all depends on how I feel, but obviously, once I am back to full health, I will be uploading as much as I possibly can, like usual. But with that being said, you guys have a great day, and thank you guys so much for supporting, and as always, people, keep on clashing.